Oh, Luca. Welcome to Carthage. Here we are, ready to explore all of what remains. Yeah! We are enjoying the wind here in Tunisia. Everywhere we go. It's really windy. Another windy day. Mas likes to say that I like to see all these old rocks. So we have a bunch of old rocks to look at, right? Yeah, it's like mommy likes it. We are on a higher level of the rest of the city so we have a nice view of the of Tunis here we have the view on the city and the view on the sea Luca, what do you think of this? Yeah. Do you think it's nice? Yeah. Did you see how decorated it is? I want to go climb it. Uh, yeah, no. Okay. <laughs> he is, but not you, only to me. Why? Great. 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 When you come and visit Carthage, if you want to take a tour or a guide, you can. They are not very expensive. She asked for uh, 40 dinar, that it's the equivalent of, let me tell you, two seconds, see I have it up <laughs> on the phone. It's 12 euros. If you want to do it, but you don't need a guide because there is uh, all the sign that they explain the site and everything. And everything is around here. And it's an actually a nice walk. The ticket? It's eight site with 12 dinar per person. So you have the amphitheater, you have the Villa Romaine, the Romaine theater, the museum, the term of Antonin, and the Megon Quarter. So it's really cool. For who didn't know, Carthage was built by the Phoenicians in the first millennium before, before Christ. Christ. After the Phoenician, there was three Punic Wars in order for the Romans to take over because they didn't like all the power that the Phoenicians were having here because of their position on the Mediterranean Sea. Yeah. And after that, this, uh, this part of, of Tunisia has been owned by different populations. It had the Arabs, the Normans, the Ottomans, the French. Everybody's been here. It's a great place to be. Uh, welcome to Wilderness Explorers 2.0. We're the Wilderness Explorers. Hello, yeah. this is me. I'm Emma and this is Pick Nose. <laughs> <laughs> he picks his nose. <laughs> And what are you doing now? We're real to exploring. <laughs> Booger, <laughs> you know what to say. We trained for this. <laughs> Go, Booger. Pick your nose every day. No, It'll no, be healthier. No, no, not that one. <laughs> not that one, Booger. Uh, the other one does Build it as explorers, save the day. Make sure you Oh. <laughs> Subscribe to the Five Wood Explorers. Oh, and Build it as explorers. Build it as explorers, save the... Yeah, Oh, oh, hang on. Oh, oh, this is dirty. Mama's gonna be really mad. Everybody wants to be your guide here. Yeah. Mas, what's this? It's an amphitheater. Or what remains of Roman it? Roman amphitheater. They were bringing all the people they The gladiators. The gladiator or the animal. Oh. I'll see you on the other side. Oh, 
Luca. Hi. We're going inside the, the bottom part of this amphitheater. Let's go. It's very dark down here. Oh, look, there's a hole. You can see mom. Hi, mom. Mom. Hi. Hi. There you are. I'm here. Let's see what else there is in this place. Hi, mom. Then we have a giant room. Mom. Oh, it's another hole. Mom. And there's Luca. Calling for mom again. You have to come. Look, let me show you a way. Just go over there. And so we're off. Dun dun dun. So we have a giant cage right here. Where I'm assuming they kept lions. Or bears, maybe. Or lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. Okay, GoPro, have a nice day. We'll leave you here with the lions. <laughs> now we're going to go to the other side of the amphitheater. So first, we came in from right up here. Now we went in that hole. Then we went over there. Then we're going this way. Let's see where it takes us. There's a dark place in there. This looks like where they kept crazy people. Very dark. Do you see anything? I don't see anything. Seems like moments where like you look inside and then it's just like, Wah! something just pops out. Like, Psh! and here are the stairs to get out. And that is what inside the amphitheater's bottom piece. And here's the top part. Oh look, you could just walk on this. Look, there's tiny little ants going. Hello. And now you will experience the adventurous part of this place now that it's all covered in beautiful flowers. Let's go. was the very adventurous flowery area of this whole thing. Oh, and there's Luca, all the way at the top. Oh, just go from there and then climb up. Okay, here we go, we're climbing up. Oh, and there's another lion cage over there. Oh, this is a big step. Oh, we did it. We made it up. Ta-da, and here you can see the whole entire amphitheater. And now Luca's gonna go back down. Applaud, yes, thank you very much. I did a very good job, thank you, thank you. Now we leave this wonderful amphitheater. We're gonna follow Luca. There he goes. Speed this up. Oh, oh, that was a little scary. Was it? Ah! Sorry about that. <laughs> I had a little bit of a fall there. <laughs> Luca, the brave adventurer. Dun, 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 and he's leaving. Wait, how am I gonna get down? No! <laughs> huh? oh. All right, let's go. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Luca, and I, the brave adventure is going on an adventure. Right, see you later. Let's go, Luca, come here. Wait. Okay, we're gonna try this tiny little slide that's right here outside. This what's is that the slide to back HQ. We're oh. Going back HQ. oh, we're going back to HQ, all yeah. right. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, we're whoa. in a portal. Whoa, shaky portal. Whoa, we're going up. Whoa, you. This portal takes a long time. This is a very long portal. Hold on. It's going And now, we keep going. Okay, stop. Okay, we need another portal. Emma. We are at the a concert. <laughs> at in what place? At the in a amphitheater. In a Roman theater. Uh, I was going to say that. Now it looks like there's it. concerts down here because there's all the lighting and the like, stage. So I'm pretty sure in this huge line area, I'm pretty sure there's a humongous line of people always here. <laughs> Side. Let's go 
see the show. I wonder what they're playing today. It's called The Quiet, <laughs> version 8. <laughs> Who guys impressed? I'm kind of impressed too, I must admit. This is pretty cool. It is. remains of the Roman villas. So thirsty. I'm going to die of thirst. <gasps> the GoPro has wire! Well, go, they go, 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 go. the necropolis here, so the cemetery, so you could kind of stay here. This is all that remains. This area was actually the containers for the amphoras the other container that they have at the time Hi. and they use it for the wine they just put the wine here until they don't drink it yeah cool you got double on uh, windows oh wow, that's very smart very fancy for Ooh. are you sure this is a villa and not a giant cinnamon roll i guess this is where they can they sell the floors <laughs> Oh, time for Luca's turn! Okay, the dance! You just go out there. Or you can get out from here. And there's an ending that's dark, and I don't want to go in there so I can see. The ending is just. There's even stairs. And I want to tell you one joke. Why does the skunk cross the road? Because you have to go, you have to get away from the giant chicken that eat him. Aha! We're going on to the top. Roman villas. The Romans had uh, villas. Can you believe it? Lots and lots of grass for Luca to run in. Ah! Oh, okay. No, no, no! Get over here. <laughs> Welcome to the Roman villa with very etched foreground. I'm Emma Desanti, your real estate agent today. Here we have Luca Desanti, our potential buyer. Hello, sir. Today, as we're your real estate agent, I'll be showing you around this house. Here we have a nice outdoor floor padding, a nice wall with a vine and trick a kits. And you have a wonderful Half headless wooden house. statue. <laughs> a lovely, old, very reserved headless woman statue, which has all the intricate, intricate. Wonder what's here. Lines. <laughs> Sir, maybe don't stand on the a thousand year old floors. <laughs> no, no, wait, it's our toes. <laughs> we have the very etched drawings of marble. What a lovely sculpture here. The, the columns, they give you a wonderful home sit here. Hey, this is Bob from Home Depot. Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> here we have a second column, a much more messy, fabric sheet later. and And over here, this is the bathroom. It comes with um, nothing inside, but there's a nice window over here to um, bedroom number one. Uh, Let me see. The guest bedroom. Let me see. So the guests can climb through the window. Me... Now here we are with column number 3.0. And here's my, one of my favorite sculptures, the Reedless. This man has no head, hardly any arms, no body, but a wonderful sculpture. And the grand finale, the terrace, where you can see everything. Now, as you can see, there's the extra columns of 2.0, 3.0. Oh, and here, this is their bathtub. Here you can add some diving columns, although I wouldn't suggest diving because it's a very shallow pool. Our wonderful view. This is a, our best Roman villa on the real estate agent's agency. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. What would you say? Our house is good for the price of $4 million? No. Oh. <laughs> Buyers, they don't know what they're and, talking and, and about. Like, this is like this is a thousand-year-old thing that lasted a thousand-year-old years. 
Luca has a woman's body now. Hey. That's what Luca does. So, what would you say about this real estate house, sir? <gasps> would you buy it? Uh, yeah. Would from me? Hmm? I wanted zero. Um, one hour, um, <laughs> stars. Ah, I don't know what that means. That's it for our real estate agency. Ooh. I hope you'll come again. Once again, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten at real estate agency. Okay, we made it to the sea. There's more ruins here. There's many spots that you can go visit. We kind of stop now. <laughs> this is what's left of the neighborhood. A frog just jumped in the water. Wow. We find out that we were really close the other day. And now our friend Maha, <laughs> she show us the port. This was actually the original port from Carthage. And now it's, uh, it's much... Kamatage? <gasps> Dr. Strange is here! <laughs> <laughs> so now it's much smaller than it was at that time. But it was actually very famous at that time because they were uh, importing, exporting a lot of stuff in this Wait, port. Like Morocco, Egypt and Lebanon. Yeah, because of the position. It was exactly, perfect. Yeah. Yeah. It was what? in the middle of, of the Mediterranean Sea. She is actually a very passionate farmer. We went to visit her farm the other day and you should see how happy she no, was. No, I'm not going to try that. <laughs> visit Tunisia yeah. hey guys so here we are look at this beautiful okay. face write in the comments if he is the most lovely <laughs> I know aren't I beautiful more beautiful than this ugly lady hey. well, I'm supposed to tell you something very important <laughs> what it's very sad matter really Emma has a secret a secret and you know what it is that she <laughs> <laughs> I think I know what you wish for. You wish to be thrown in the ocean. Why do I wish that? Say goodbye to this wonderful amphitheater. Luca would like to say something to you. Put more down to our channel. Bye bye. And I subscribe to our YouTube channel. Do not forget to do that. And like and put the bell because if you like notifications, you will like us very much. You know why? Because we have very nice view. And if you look at notifications, hey, we'll give you nice stuff to watch. See you later.